Hi everyone, it's Chris Hansen here, Senior Solution Consultant at Adobe, and today I want to talk to you about Auto Reframe within Premiere Pro. Now this feature automatically reframes your video to suit different aspect ratios. And by doing this, it will take the subject within the shot and using Adobe Sensei, which is our artificial intelligence, it has the ability to automatically track that subject and keep it within the frame no matter what aspect ratio that it is. Now this feature is very handy when it comes to things like reframing your videos for social media, such as Facebook, Instagram, and even YouTube, where they commonly use aspect ratios such as square video, vertical video, so you've got 16 by nine, nine by 16, or even a four by three cut, and obviously square uh, video. Now you would typically use this at the end of your editing process. And the reason for that is that you would take the single video that you've just finished editing and then create multiple aspect ratios to suit the different platforms that you will be sharing your video to. So if you watched my previous video on auto reframe in Premiere Rush, you'll notice I'm using the same clip so you can see how it would work within Premiere Pro now. Now as you can see here, I've got my footage in the timeline and I've got a ski arm that's moving back and forth, left to right. It's gonna hit play so you can see that motion. In order to reframe this particular skier sequence, it's as simple as going to the skier sequence over here and then going to auto reframe sequence. Now as I click on that, you'll notice it brings up a dialog box. Now within here, I can do a number of things. I can name that sequence. I can choose the target aspect ratio. And this is where you would typically choose whether it be vertical video, nine by 16, four by five, or even the horizontal one, as we mentioned earlier. By choosing one of these, let's go with vertical nine by 16. And in this dropdown, you can choose what type of motion that you have that you want to track. As you can see here, I'm just gonna leave it at default. Now I'm just gonna hit create. And this is where Adobe Sensei kicks in and automatically runs that tracking motion. So you can see it's already reframed the clip. And if I hit play, notice how the subject is being followed. And now this is where Sensei found that subject and then implemented keyframes. Now I wanted to show you that right here. If I come over to effect controls, when I select auto reframe, you notice as I scrub through, th this is the video now. The video is moving to keep the subject in frame. As you can see, it's doing it like that right there. Now this is really important because previously this was a manual process. You'd have to individually keyframe particular sections within this video to make sure that your subject stays within that frame. And that's it guys, just a quick video to show you auto reframe within Premiere Pro, the ability to reframe your videos for other social media platforms. If you wanna have a look at one of my previous videos on how to use auto reframe in Premiere Rush, have a look at it right here. That's it, hope you liked it. Hit the like button if you did, and hit the subscribe button if you wanna see more. And remember, never stop creating.